yo what's up guys well, welcome back to across nigeria how are you guys doing today i hope everyone is doing wonderful today is the seventh day of february 2020 my time here is three o'clock in the afternoon so good morning good afternoon and good evening depends where you are listening from i bring you a particularly sad news on this very day about the passing of my mother Following the death of the parents of uh, the leader of IPOB, I'm talking about Mazinam Dekanu last year, which are to be buried next weekend. So that is what um, uh, I just want to talk about and give you the update so far. Um, talking about the preparation, what is happening so far. Okay, so Mr. Kanu, who has been on self exile since 2017 when the army invaded his um, resident during operation python dance so there are all indication that can will be arrested if he attends the burial okay but so far the ohani zendibu youth council worldwide today being friday uh, the seventh day of february begs president buhari to grant namdi kanu um, presidential pardon and allow him to enter the country allow him entry into the country to attend his parent burial so in a joint statement uh, by Okechuku, the president the president general and the secretary okui made the recommendations following the military presence around the community since the announcement of uh, his parent burial the ohan is a youth express worry over the continued presence of the army in that area and call for withdrawal so according to the group such presence of the military could further damage uh, the image of president barrier administrations um, in the eyes of international community so according to them they say they are worried about the military presence in kanu's village that is afaruku umo here in abia state few days to the burial of his father his real majesty eze okanu and his wife so for them um they appeal to president buhari to consider the international damage it's gonna cause okay and the reputation to nigeria and outside international community that are watching to see if there will be any form of human rights violations and abuse of nigerians military before uh, during and after the burial rite of Namdi Kano's um, parents next weekend. Okay, so uh, today is the seventh day of February. Okay, so next weekend, um, today is Friday. So Ohanize insists that um, no need for any provocative actions promoting violence by Nigerian military before and during the burial. Okay, that Buari should pull out his military and accord the last respect for the late king by granting permission and presidential pardon to Namdekanu to return and bury his parents according to Igbo tradition and culture. There is nothing amiss if President Buhari in person or through a high power delegation attend and send condolence message uh, to the people of Afarukumo here on the demise of the Aparamang ruler is a Kanu and his wife so such presidential gest gesture will portray him as a good father of the nation irrespective of the self-evidence ipod stands on self-determination and fight against injustice meted out during Igbo since biafra war that is um 50 years ago all right guys so um that is the update i have for you uh, concerning the burial of uh, the leader of IPOB, Mazi Namdekanu, which um, is going to take place next weekend. And um, so far, uh, there is every indication, okay, we've talked about this several times, okay, if Namdekanu will be allowed or if he will be able to attend uh, the parents' burial. Remember, he's the first son, okay, so. Um, traditionally he should be around um, even before now to you know the preparation and other things okay so 
you, you would have been around to monitor the whole process but uh, so far it's not around it's not in nigeria so um there is every speculation that if he attends the parents barrier that is going to be arrested remember he is standing trial at the federal high court he was granted bail okay and um, for some people they said he jumped bail while for some he had to escape for his dear life uh, because of the army invasion during the operation python dance okay so um, it was not uh, a jumping bell so that is according to ipob while the nigerian um, some nigerians said that um, he jumped bell and the federal high court um, so far demand um, the presence of Nam de Kano. So that is a, a very big uh, problem there because uh, for some people he jumped bail. So I really don't see the reason why he should not be arrested if um, he steps into Nigeria. I'm trying to look at the possibility of what Buhani is here, the president, the presidential pardon by President Buhari. Okay. So uh, for me, for me, I'm just going to give you my own humble opinion. You can also put your own opinion on the comment section below. Because everybody is trying to look at the possibility of this request by Ohanize uh, Youth Council Worldwide. Okay, everybody is trying to look at the possibility of this request. So for me, my humble opinion is that, remember some time ago, Namde Kanu says that um, he's ready. Remember, he said he's ready to come back to Nigeria. Is ready to return to Nigeria and continue his trial. All right. So uh, for me, I, I really think what Namde Kano should do, okay, um, he should be encouraged to return home to Nigeria and continue his trial. Now, if he's um, guilty of the allegations leveled against him, so that is the only time, okay. Uh, they should request for a presidential pardon. That is uh, what I am thinking. So for those of us lawyers in the house, you can also put in your contribution on the comment section below. Like I said, I'm only giving you my own humble opinion, so I may be wrong. I may be right. Okay. I only wanted to give you update that um, the Ohan is a youth is um, pleading with President Buhari to allow Namde Kanu um, come back home to bury his father okay and the mother so even if um, it, it's gonna be a presidential pardon uh, you don't expect all right you don't expect uh, the nigerian security agencies you know even if the pardon is being granted for him to come back after the barrier he should also be allowed to go back remember his standing trial and the federal high court is um, also insisting that Namde Kanu appeared in court. So um, it's going to be an opportunity for uh, him to continue his trial. But I really don't know uh, how, I really don't know the plan so far. So I just wanted to give you this update and allow you guys to put in your own contribution in the comment section below what you think. If this request by Ohani the Youth Ndibo uh, Youth Council worldwide will be granted by President Buhari, allowing Nandi Kano to come back home, bury his parents, and go back, which I personally don't see the possibility there. All right. So that was the reason why I said, based on my own opinion, maybe this is the the time he should, you know, come back home to Nigeria. Remember. Some time ago, he said he was ready. He was not denying the fact that um, he has a, a pending case in the federal high court. He said he was ready, but he feared for his life. That was his problem. That if Nigeria, uh, the Nigeria, it, the Nigerian security will guarantee his safety. That was what Nam Kano said. That if his safety will be guaranteed, that he's ready. To come back to Nigeria, continue his trial, okay. And for me, I believe if 
eventually he's found guilty so i don't talk about court cases when it is there in the court okay so we allow the court to handle it so like i said if eventually he's found guilty with no one knows that is the only time he can talk about or people should talk about presidential pardon so uh, that is my own point of view here all right guys let me stop there and allow you to put in your contribution on the comment section below and um, a lot of people is also on the side of him coming back uh, to face his trial and i believe well I, I really don't want to talk about this okay i'm only here to let me give you the update and um, allow you to put in your contribution on the comment section below don't forget if this is your first time part of your effort to support us is to subscribe so you get update whenever we have stories or news like this to share with you guys across nigeria see you guys in another video